I'm Susanna. Add a little bling to your dessert by preparing Jell-O's Sparkling Raspberry Jigglers. This is a fun one to make with the kids. So let's start out by adding two quarter ounce packets of Knox unflavored gelatin to our bowl here. So there's one. Let's add this second one. This is so easy to make. I love it. So let's add to that two tablespoons of sugar. I like to let my kids do the measuring on the little things like this. And then let's add two cups of carbonated lemon lime soda to the bowl. And now I'm just gonna give that a quick stir and we're just gonna let this sit for three minutes until that gelatin softens. The gelatin softens, so what we wanna do now is pop this bowl in the microwave for three minutes on high, stirring after each minute, and we want the gelatin and the sugar to be completely dissolved. The gelatin and sugar are completely dissolved from the microwave. So let's pour this right into our eight by eight baking pan that's been coated with cooking spray. So all we need to do now is put this into the refrigerator for 25 to 30 minutes until set but not firm. Time for the next layer of this dessert. So to my bowl, I'm adding two packets of Jell-O raspberry flavored gelatin. So there's one packet. Let's add the second. This gives it a great flavor. There we go. And on top of this, I have one and a quarter cups of boiling water. So let's pour that right over. Gives it a nice vibrant color right away. And let's stir this for two minutes until that gelatin is completely dissolved. So the last ingredient we're going to put in here is a quarter cup of water. Now my adults out there, if you want to get a little creative, you can substitute for a more adult version of this, a quarter cup of raspberry liqueur instead of this water at this point. So this is a quarter cup of cold water. So now we're gonna let this sit for 15 minutes. We want it to cool a little bit before we pour it over that other layer that's cooling off in the refrigerator. Our raspberry gelatin is cooled, so very carefully, I'm gonna pour it over our clear gelatin mixture. So here we go. There. And now we'll refrigerate this for one hour or until it's firm. Our dessert is firm, so here's where the fun happens. This is where we have to flip this out. So what I usually like to do, I get a knife and run it right along the rim, and then I get my cutting board out, or if you have a platter at home or a square-shaped plate, and I put it right over the top, and then you have to be quick. One quick flip. So there we go. Put it down flat. Let's gently peel this off. Oh, this looks great. Super. So let's just cut this into 36 equal squares. Start right down the middle here. All right, so now we're plating them up for friends and family. And what I really like to do is serve them with fresh raspberries because I think it brings out that raspberry flavor that we had and the jello raspberry. So put those right on the plate. Just up that presentation. How cute is that? Perfect. So I hope you enjoy this recipe. For a reduced sugar version of this recipe and other great Jell-O recipes, visit Jell-O.com.